Hello all, welcome back. So we'll continue our Google Cloud AI and ML services. So in previous video, we have seen more about a Vision API, how we can use Vision API to get insight from the image, how we can use it in a cloud shell or a Python script. Okay, so now in this video, we are going to learn more about a NLP API that is Natural Language Processing API. So that is used to derive insight from unstructured text using a Google machine learning. So we'll see the demo here again, as we saw in the last video. So first we'll see a demo here and I'll try to explain the out type of output it produce. So suppose I want to use this API to get the insight of the sense sentiment of the user. So mostly nowadays this NLP API is used to get insight of the customer product reviews. So they will scan all the reviews and they will get report on the customer sentiments. If customers are happy or the sentiments are positive or the sentiments are negative. Okay. So I'll just type something here and I'll show you how it will show output based on my sentiment. So I'll just type, uh, wow, this is very good ice cream just type something so it means I am just giving a positive response here and this is a very small sentence ideally we should give a large or a big statements but I'm just giving very small and I'll try to analyze so first it will detect the entities in this sentence what are the entities so ice cream so it detected one entities that is ice cream now I'll go to sentiment so it should show green or a red. So green means it's a positive response from a customer or a positive sentiment. If it is red, it means it's a negative. Now here it will show green and red, but ideally the actual output will be positive or negative. Negative means a bad sentiment or a negative sentiment, okay? So I'll go here and you could see 0.9 means greens and it is showing a positive sentiment wow this is very good ice cream it means it's showing customer is happy or a user is happy with a magnitude so this is a magnitude or you could say this is a score of your sentiment so it is always between minus one to one so let me change from good to bad and it will turn to red because it will detect okay customer is not happy with this ice cream okay now i'll go here and you could see it turn red and everything is negative now it's showing it is minus zero eight it means customer is not happy it will detect the syntax also so what is the syntax in this sentence so this is a noun this is adjective this is a verb all details it will get from this sentence so this is we used very small demo in a demo API in a Google Cloud product page. Now I want to show this in a, our Google Cloud Shell. So I'll go to Cloud Shell and I will try to get some more details or a big sentences now. So I'll open a Cloud Shell first. Okay, and uh, suppose I want to just want to just type today's news and get some random news and i'll try to analyze sentiment from that news okay so latest news i'll get okay so there was a plane crash in nepal so i will get this news and i will try to find a sentiments from this news so i'll copy complete uh, this paragraph or this complaint and we don't need or we have to avoid any special characters so I'll copy this and first I will use my notepad to remove any special characters like this here is also I'll remove this here also else it will take as a single quote I think that's it so let me now copy and paste so we first check the syntax how we can use this so as usual i'll type gcloud ml space double tab okay now i will type language double tab and i want to analyze the sentiment so i type analyze 
sentiment and now hyphen hyphen content is equal to in the single quote I will put all my content okay so I can remove the line space between that so let me remove that And let me enter okay it throw an error so did you mean content did I missed spelling okay my spelling is wrong so let me correct it and run okay let me execute now okay we got an output let me copy this output first and we'll see in a notepad so from here I have output so I'll copy this I'll go here and I'll just paste here okay now each sentence will have a sentiment analysis now this is the sentence you could see the local resident Kalpana Sunar was washing classes in front of yard of her house and that time he saw the plane crashed okay so here you could see the sentiment it's minus it means it's negative sentiment it is not a good news so it will show a minus so all these article will have a negative sentiments you could see because this is not a good news it's about a people died in a crash so it won't give any positive sentiment here so again out of this sentiment I want to just find one more thing I want to find the entities in this paragraph what are the entities if there is any person mentioned is there any organization is there any school is there any a celebrity name is there so I want to find entities mention this paragraph so I will use another option here here instead of analyze sentiment I will do analyze entities and I will enter okay so now it is showing uh, entities here we will see what are the entities it is mentioned So I will copy this so this is very big output I will start from the first line yeah so here you could see the first mentioned entity person what is the name of the person Kalpana Sunar okay then again it detected a uh, washing cloths means it detected entity cloths then a location it detected a house as a location so it is just categorizing the entities so it detected a aircraft from the paragraph then it detected a resort city location it's detected a pokhara as a city so all entities it recovered from our paragraph so now what we'll do we'll just try to do again a sentiment analysis using one of the product review from a flipkart or a amazon i'll go on a flipkart and i'll try to get review from one of the product okay so i'll go for the shoes i'll go for one of the shoes and I'll get the reviews from a customer a review section. Okay, where I can get a reviews. Okay, here are a reviews. So good quality product. So I'll put this line. So these are the point positive sentiments. So it should give me a positive result. G cloud ML language okay so I'll try to find sentiment based on this review and here you could see it is showing 0.9 it means person is almost very happy with this product now I will do I'll just change on instead of a good I'll just change it to a bad quality product okay and it should 
go in minus now and instead of comfort i'll just type discomfort and we'll see if it is changed yeah now you could see it changed to negative sentiments it means person is not happy with this product so whenever any big organization or a consumer sites they just analyze their all reviews using this a uh, sentiment analysis or a uh, nlp even a large organization arranging the feedback so they won't go for each and every feedback they received from different customer or employee they'll just run their nlp on that collection of feedbacks and they will find a collected output or summarized output if all employees are happy or there are any negative sentiments in the employee so for this all things this uh, nlp or natural language processing is used hope you are clear okay one more thing we missed uh, here so i just show you how we can use this with the python as well so i already created a python file here nlp.py so you could see you can copy this from the description or you will get this code in a google cloud documentation so here what i am writing here i am very tired of this work so this is a single line i am giving and based on this line it should give my sentiment if i am positive or i am feeling negative okay i'll close this and i'll try to run okay and it should show the magnitude here you could see it's showing minus six it means i am not happy or i am tired or i am having a negative sentiments currently based on this text so if i change anything it will just change the sentiment based on my sentence so we can use this nlp API in python also and we can implement in small scale application so as i give you idea so you can implement uh what i can say you can implement one uh, python based application which will scan all the a uh, text file from the storage bucket which contains the feedback from different customer and you can find output based on all feedback and you can aggregate it like if overall customer base is happy with your feedback or with your product or the customer is having a negative sentiment so you can try to implement this so we'll see you in a next video thank you for watching this video